And, and they're this group. There's some people look at them the, like the Illuminati. Anybody can join, by the way, but they have this kind of like mysterious yeah, order yeah. to it. Mason Lodges. The Mason Lodges. We saw all these things. Now, if you look, what's that right there, Taylor? It's a pyramid, right? With an all-seeing eye on top. And if you look at a lot of like big American cities, even in Central Park, you'll see it. And D.C., you'll see it. The Washington Monument is a big- All-seeing eye? Is, well, no, it's a big obelisk. You've seen those like big pointy, almost pyramid-like structures? The Washington Monument is the only monument- that doesn't have the guy on it. Yeah. It's the Washington Monument, but for some reason, it's just this big, tall pyramid shape. Yeah, it's yeah. like, why is there like this Egyptian influence in American and Western philosophy and culture? Yeah. And what these guys believe, and correct me if I'm wrong, Mason folks, but what these guys believe is, is that there was alien influence. Had to be. And there continues to be alien influence. And that every once in a while in history, not necessarily alien, but higher power, whatever you want to believe it is, right? An alien that would control shit for us would be a higher power. It would be God, essentially. And every once in a while, they push humanity on the right course. They nudge humanity in the right direction, right? So we're essentially a game or an experiment of, them, of theirs. And that explains all these amazing things throughout history. The pyramids, for example, electricity, Right. Benjamin Franklin, you've heard the story about the kite and the key, right? They're like, they're like, that's not what really happened. Which sounds like total bullshit. Of now. course it's bullshit. <laughs> of course it's bullshit. Like that should sound but, like such but, bullshit. But, now. but as you know, more than anyone, you need a story to sell the people on it. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. you can't just go, hey, aliens come in and they influence and they told me about this electricity thing that's gonna give us an amazing advantage in the new world. That's not a story you can put in the newspaper. People, it buy. could be if you could if the if the aliens told it. If you got these aliens that are showing you like they can do all of this wild, but they shit. don't want to be known, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, maybe they push people in the right direction without even telling them. I mean, in a lot of ways it could describe religion. It describes all these things. Maybe they give them some information, and then people go left with it or they go right mm -hmm. with it. But still, it is an interesting way of looking at history and looking at these amazing events that happen in history, and and trying to fully understand why these events turn out that way. You know, and it's like, is it influence? Is it culture? What is it? The reward system? You who knows what it is, but it, it is uncanny the influence of like these like Egyptian obelisks and all this like as a, Egyptian art. As, a, art as a human who's seen flying saucers before, right? I uh, saw my first one when I was eight years old, right? In Monk's Corner, South Carolina, hovering over the trees in my grandmother's yard. Yeah. Uh, as a human who's been visited, imagine how by disappointing before. it would be to travel from millions of light years away. And end up at Monk's Corner, South Carolina. <laughs> That's exactly where you Can would want to be. Imagine of all the shit to see in the world. You got the pyramids. Hey, man, remember my great uncle made those pyramids? We got to check those pyramids. That's and where you, you would want to be. In Monk's Corner. Yes. The Great Wall of China. And I'm going to experiment on this little motherfucker right here and put all types of shit in his body and make him phenomenal to show the world how great we are. Who were you not molested by? Who do you think? <laughs> <laughs> your aunt wants you. The aliens. How do you not feel worthy? You're the chosen one, motherfucker. That's right, goddammit. You're right. Listen, remember when I came in here and I had those cuts on both part my legs? You remember that? Yeah. When I had the cuts on both shins Did in the same cuts exact on your place? Hands too? I've had those. I used to have them right here. You can still see the scars right here. Jesus. Bro. Listen, I know aliens have been experimenting on me for a long time. Really? You know who else aliens built? The Joe Rogan podcast. Look really? At, look at Joe Rogan's logo. Look at his logo, God damn it. Ooh, you ain't never hold on. Conspiracy hold Charlotte. On. Conspiracy hold Charlotte. On. Hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You on. You, you, what the fuck is that? <laughs> oh, clues bomb. Hold on. You ain't never paid attention Wait to Joe Rogan's so logo. So have you been probed and shit? Is that Absolutely. why you like it when your girl puts her finger in your butt? Come on now. Look at that. What, what, what does Joe Rogan have on his logo? Yeah, the, also, the third eye. That's the right. Eye. What's but my what's Joe my not, believes in all this. What's my non-profit called? For years. For 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 20 plus decades. Huh? Third eye awareness. Third eye awareness, baby. Oh, Come on now. Oh, shit. The aliens know what they're doing. Aliens out here creating some of the greatest media personalities of our generation. <laughs> <laughs> all right? Okay? So we can spread the word about them. All right? And we believe in them. All right? We letting them know the goodness of them and God. Yo, aliens, we appreciate you, man. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you, man. Keep us these blessings, man. It's been working out. We appreciate you. Y'all keep it up, man. Whenever you're ready, you ready to pull up. Yo, Jesus up there like, let him call me an alien one more time. <laughs> call me a motherfucking alien one more time. And you know what I would say to Jesus? They <laughs> call you and all your friends illegal aliens, okay? <laughs> <laughs> They're building a wall for you and all your illegal friends. Illegal friends. Yo! Hey, Zeus. Whoa. You know what I'm saying?